Do Las Vegas short sale homes provide for big discounts? This is the fourth video in the Comprehensive Guide for Las Vegas Short Sales series. In the last three videos, we discussed the three different ways of buying Las Vegas short sale homes, condos, or high-rise condominiums that are listed in the Las Vegas MLS. Why do buyers and real estate investors make offers on them, and how long does it take to close short sale deals? In this video, we will discuss the discount gain through buying short sales. As we mentioned, Massive spent about eight days and analyzed all of the 177 Greater Las Vegas short sale homes that sold or closed escrow in February 2015. What we talk about is the results of this research. Before we continue, we must mention that one significant factor that influences comprehensive market analysis is the property condition. The definition of a home sold in fair condition is that the home is fit to live in but needs extensive repairs. A home in poor condition means that the property needs extensive repairs and is not fit to live in. For example, walls are missing. These definitions have nothing to do with whether or not the house is kept in neat and picked up condition or not. However, be warned that although there are guidelines for property conditions, many Las Vegas realtors do not know about or follow the guidelines. The following is an exact quote from a short sale listing. Las Vegas home in need of many repairs but in good condition. The correct category would be fair condition. Another had mold problems which make the home unfit for living in and still was classified in good condition. We corrected the property condition for listings that we studied to the extent that we could. We were able to do a market analysis or a CMA on 121 out of 177 sold homes. We couldn't do so for the rest due to lack of pictures of the interior of the home, which happens a lot in the case of short sales, or because the house was in poor condition. In other instances, the home was a custom-built home and usually in fair or poor condition. Here is the breakdown of short sale homes by property condition. As you can see, 48% of all short sale homes were classified as fair or poor condition. So much for the myth that short sales are usually in better condition than foreclosures. It is not true at all. The most expensive Greater Las Vegas short sale homes that sold in February had a sales price of $2.375 million and the cheapest one sold for $49,000. This table shows the breakdown of sales prices for the rest of the short sale houses. It is easy to see that 71% of total short sales were sold for less than $200,000, while only 47% of total home sales were sold for less than $200,000. This is one of the main reasons that the median price of short sales in February at $158,000 was $49,000 less than the median price for total home sales. Of the 121 short sale homes that we were able to do a CMA on, the two most expensive short sales that were sold in February 2015 provided for the most discounts. One was a $2.375 million luxury home, and the other was a $572,000 Seven Hills Probate short sale luxury home running the golf course in poor condition, and the savings were in the tens of thousands of dollar range. This table shows discounts gained through buying short sales for the other 121 short sale houses that we could do a CMA on. As you can see, just about 50 or 60 percent of the Las Vegas Henderson and North Las Vegas short sales were purchased with prices that were within $10,000 of current market value. 44 homes, or 36.5 percent of the total sold for $10,000 to $19,000 in discounts, and only 14% sold for more than $20,000 in discounts. Other than Las Vegas short sales that were enrolled in an online auction by the lender, the most important factor in gaining discounts was how long the listing had stayed on the market without an offer. The other important factor is how much repairs did the house need to bring it up to good condition. Homes in very good and excellent condition in lower price ranges did not sell for much discount, as Las Vegas real estate investors still buy these. However, more expensive homes that do not provide for acceptable cash flow and need extensive repairs have been sold for the most discounts. 
50% of short sales sold through hubzoo.com online auction got more than $20,000 in discounts. We could perform a CMA on 8 out of 18 listings that were sold through homesearch.com auction. 4 out of 8 buyers got a discount of equal or less than $10,000. The other 4 were sold for less than $25,000 in discounts. It is interesting to note that 10 out of 18 had bidding that surpassed the asking list price in the Las Vegas MLS. Three out of four bankruptcy short sales that we could perform a CMA on sold for $12,000 to $20,000 in discounts. If you are willing to wait for more than a year, pre-approved short sales can save you about $15,000. We could only do one CMA for the one out of four combination probate short sales. This was the golf course home we, which we talked about and the discount was big. Other than two cases, as expected, approved short sales have sold for the least discount. The reason is that approved short sales are treated like foreclosures and many sell quickly after being approved. Two out of the 25 that we did a CMA on sold for $7,500 to $10,000 higher than comps. These buyers got a reverse discount. Eight sold for no discount. Another eight sold for less than $10,000 in discount, and only seven listings were sold for up to $25,000 in discount. Unapproved short sales do better than approved short sales and get higher discounts. However, the buyer has to live with the possibility that the seller's hardship could be rejected or getting a high, high counter offer from the bank that leads to breaking the deal, and this happens a lot. In the past, we've repeatedly written that we pay no attention to unapproved short sales, and the reason was that we were in an appreciating market. After months of waiting by the buyer, prices had gone up and the bank would counter at the latest prices with an appreciating market premium built in. In a flat market, there is no danger of that, so now we will make offers on all types of short sales if conditions are right. We are not going to discuss all our findings in this short video. However, after sweating the details and performing the tedious work of doing a CMA on 121 listings for no pay, we now know how and where to look for the highest discounts and can authoritatively advise our clients. Getting good in Las Vegas real estate, like in any other field, requires 95% sweat, which we are really good at. We don't know what the other 5% is. Those who have watched all of the videos in our Las Vegas short sale series should have a pretty good idea about them too. If you want to buy or invest in Las Vegas Henderson or North Las Vegas short sale homes, condos, or townhomes in the immediate future, please call us at 800-762-4917. Please like and share if you find this information useful and subscribe to our Las Vegas real estate channel for upcoming videos. This is Karen Sabrazade of Realty One Group and www.lasvegasforus.com wishing you a great day.